<clears throat> okay, I'm going to show you how to play O Come All Ye Faithful. Um, what you do is, we're going to start with a C. Now we're going to use the same language here. I'm capoed in the 2nd fret, but we're going to call this fret 1, 2, 3, 4, and strings 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, like that. Okay, so from a C position, we should be in tune. Okay, on a C position then, all you do is you pluck the set the first fret second string then pluck all of the strings except the outer E strings so it's then you only pluck three four and five then pluck the second string okay now you shift your fingers to third fret second string uh, string and then second fret up here fifth string and then you have your two opens in the in between you strum those then then you that was all four that you just strummed then the next strum you're just going to do three four and five so it's you put on the third fret you put your um, your finger on the fifth string and then leave the you're gonna play the first string at the same time okay then put your finger on the third fret second string and then second fret fifth string Then you go shift to the third fret, fifth string, and an open first. Put your finger, index finger on the first string, first fret, and play again the fifth string open now. Okay, once. And then put the finger on third fret, sixth string, and an open on the bottom, first string. So, so far we have this. Now you put your baby finger here on the third fret, second string. Then put it index on the first fret, second string. Then, then add your second fret, third string baby finger on the fourth fourth fret fourth string pluck open second third string and on the third third string with the second fret push that one and then pluck third and fourth then open again the second third now plant your index on the first fret second string and then plant your other finger on the second fret, fourth string. I'm sorry. Then third fret, second string. Then you bring it, you have your index finger to second fret, fifth string. Then third fret, fifth string and open first string and then all three two three four open then put your finger on the uh, third string on the second fret pluck three and four and that's open then put your third fret, sixth string, and then pluck again, three and four. So it's gonna go like this, real slow.
that's lesson one. Practice that over and over and over to get that just that section, and then move on. And you should listen to my the song all the way through that I have on the Little Picker channel. Um, you, you know, before you go on, so you get a feel of how this is going to sound. Okay, this is the fun part of the song. Now, most people like to play it like this. But I like to add in. So together it sounds like this. And the way you do it is, put your, your ring finger on the 3rd fret 1st string, put your index on the 2nd fret 4th string, and then pluck an open 3rd string. Now the next strings we're going to mess with are going to be 1, 3, and 4. But what we're going to do is hammer on to the 3rd and pluck four open. So it's... Okay, now what you're going to do is press third fret, fifth string, and open one and two. So it's... Now you're going to go back to bar these, play these, one and two, and then pluck four. So it's... Um, once you get past that, that might take you a little bit, but um, once you get past it, put your ring on the ring finger on the 3rd fret 2nd string, and then 2nd uh, fret 5th string, and then you go to 3rd fret, 3rd string, 5th uh, string, open 1st string. Put your index on the 1st fret 2nd string, and an open 5th and then put your uh, ring finger on the 3rd fret, 2nd string, and then you put your index on the 1st fret, 6th string. And then you put your finger on the 3rd fret, 6th string, and an open 2nd. And then what you do is index this string here, 3rd string on the 2nd fret. Then you do a C, and then put your finger here, which is 3rd fret, 2 and 4. Then an open 3rd string. So it's... Then you put a... You keep your uh, index on the 1st fret, 2nd string, pluck the bottom 2, So it's, so I'm sorry, so what you do is you, you pluck 1 and 2 and put your finger on the 2nd string, 1st fret. Then you put your finger, this finger on 3rd fret, 2nd string, your other finger on the 4th fret, 3rd string. Then go back to that one. Then index finger, 1st fret, 1st string, this 3rd fret. Uh, second string here. So anyway, what you got going is this. I'm going to go too far. Now you go back here to uh, third fret, second string, and uh, fourth fret, third string. And then that's it for now. We'll just do this next part. Okay, we're at the end of the song. This is part three. Um, what we're going to do is uh, go an open E, and you're going to press third fret, fifth string. And then you're going to press index finger, first fret, first string, and an open uh, fourth. And then you go back to it again. So it's. Go 
third fret, second string, second fret, fifth string, first fret, I mean, first fret, second string, and an open fifth string. Third fret, sixth string, and an open second string. And then by itself, just go to here. Bar these two, but you all, you're going to play the second and third string. So it's going to be an open string here you're going to play. So bar these two, but play second and third string and the sixth. So it's going to, these strings. So, you know, together you do it. Then you, pre you, you pluck the fifth string and then you pluck at the same time one and two. So anyway, it sounds like this. Now here you're doing a C, one, two, and five string. And here I like to go, I like to kind of just do a, um, uh, play the like a C, bring it up here, put this baby here on the 3rd uh, fret 2nd string, and then play 2, 3, and 6, and then let off that. And then you bring it down for a C like this, and then hammer on here. Okay. That's it.